Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hello to all my subscribers. Hello to all my new viewers. Um, I just want to jump in here right quick. I don't want to make this video too long. I'm actually at the house today. Um, just sitting here with a lot of different things on my mind. You all know I am um, a week away from my surgery date. It's actually next Friday um, at 8 a.m. I have to be in Houston at 11 a.m. Well, no later than 11 because I have my pre-op appointment at 11 where basically they're going to go over um, the do's and don'ts and basically what to expect. So I'm, I'm extremely excited here. Um, we haven't told the kids yet. I believe we're just going to surprise them, which is perfectly fine um, with me. I have told um, a couple of my family members, and they all seem to be extremely exciting. All of them are stating, oh, wow, Katrina, <laughs> we hope that you have a girl. So I'm like, okay, you know, I guess it doesn't really matter to us as long as it's a normal, healthy baby, we'll take it trying to remember okay so a couple of things here we did go ahead and we booked the room at Drury Inn it is in the Galleria area in Houston word of advice you all um, the young man had advised me that basically Monday Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday the prices are much more expensive versus a Friday and a Saturday for Thursday, it was like 200 bucks just for Thursday alone. And I kind of questioned the guy. I said, I'm sorry. Um, I, I don't mean to come off nasty or rude or whatever, but could you explain to me why just one night, which is Thursday, and we're talking about a very basic room, why it's $200? He explained to me that the four days out of the week, which is Monday through Thursday, that is considered the business time of the week, basically where a lot of people come into Houston. He wasn't specific as far as the area of Houston, but he just stated, you know, it's business district. I'm sorry, that's what he stated. So I said, okay, business district. And then I said, okay, how much is Friday going to cost me? I assumed it was going to be right around the same price, if not a little more, considering it is the weekend. And he stated, no, um, actually, your Friday is only going to be $99. I said, okay, $99. Okay, it sounds perfect. So we went ahead and we booked the room. So I have shared that with a few other people that are considering going to that particular doctor and probably staying in that area I will advise you all to look around shop around try to get the best rates that you all possibly can even if you all might have to drive kind of outside of Houston maybe the outskirts or maybe a subsidiary area of Houston or you know like the suburbs is what I'm wanting to say I'm sorry maybe if you all you know, if you all are on a budget and you know maybe you all only have XYZ to spend, I truly encourage you all to check out different spots and just rate check. See who can give you all the best rate and also check on, um, check to see if they offer medical discounts. If you're going to be having a medical procedure, ask them if they can give you a discounted rate. Ask them if they have some sort of, um, business doing with maybe a local hospital or a local surgery center see if they're able to provide you all um, a discounted rate so yeah we are extremely excited I know I stated in my last video that starting Monday um, I starting Monday basically this Monday coming up I would actually be vlogging or making videos Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and I'm going to try really hard <laughs> to get you all a video out on Friday as well. So essentially, those are my goals, and I'm really, truly going to try to stick to that. Um, we are going to leave early Thursday morning, and when I say early, I'm talking about extremely early, probably about 
3, 3.30 to ensure that we're there no later than 11 a.m. That's what time my pre-op appointment is. So, um, yeah, I'm going to be doing that. Oh, and also, before I forget, I actually received, or I have received a phone call. I'm sorry, let me back up. I actually called Dr. Rosenfield's office and I spoke with one of the nurse, nurses, sorry, to confirm my um, test results, you know, if anything came back abnormal or if there was something I needed to work on basically this week, this current week that we're in. And the young lady said, no, everything came back normal. So I'm actually extremely excited about that. Um, you know, I, um, it's just so much joy that's actually deep down inside. You know, you all, this is a long time coming. For some of you all that are just tuning into this video, um, I have shared in my previous video that, um, you know, if and when I get pregnant again, this will make baby four. You know, I got my tubes tied when I was 21. I know. I know I was extremely young, but sometimes you have to do what you have to do for you and your family. And depending on what your personal goals are, you know, unfortunately, certain measures um, have to be taken to ensure um, to ensure certain things don't happen. I don't think I need to elaborate in that aspect. I think a lot of us <laughs> kind of get where I'm going with this. So. Yeah, I'm extremely excited. I know one young lady had asked me to keep an update on um, basically the doctor I will be using. So again, you all, this Dr. Rosenfeld. He is based out of Houston, Texas. He is a specialist in this particular line of business. Again, he has over 30 years of experience, which in my book is a huge, huge great big plus in my book so you know I feel that I am in good hands I feel like you know me and my husband we made the right decision for our family and I just know that you know he's going to make sure everything is taken care of from A to Z so you guys be on the lookout for my video I will try to get that video updated in regards to my um basically like my travel travel bag I'm sorry I'll go ahead and start putting some things in there Sunday um, and finish up on Monday and then by Tuesday I should be ready to upload another video in regards to that so you all again if you all have any questions or concerns just leave them down below in the comment box you know kind of be specific so I know exactly how to answer your questions um, don't be shy you know I'm a very free nature type person. Don't be shy. Ask me. Ask me whatever you'd like to ask me in regards to your TTC journey as far as trying to get your um, tubes reversed. So, you guys, yeah, I'm excited. I'm so glad that you all are able to come along this journey with me. And, you know, throughout this whole entire journey, I want to just give you all a piece of me, um, give you all a piece of my life in hopes that I can inspire you to fulfill whatever dreams you all may have. So that is my goal to you all as well as myself. So until next time, you all have a safe evening and good night.